Science O'Clock Junior Pepper's Lab. Wow! Look at all these lights. They look so beautiful. Oh, hi everyone. My name is Pepper, and I am from Kidstop. November is a special month as we celebrate Deepavali, also known as the Festival of Lights. To celebrate Deepavali, many people light up oil lamps and decorate their homes with colourful lights. But I wonder why people do that. I know, I shall call for my friend Chilene who knows lots of stories. Chilene! Hi! Hi everyone! Hi Pepper! Hi boys and girls! My name is Jelaine and I'm from Singapore Repertory Theatre. Hello Jelaine! Oh, I wonder why many people light up oil lamps during Deepavali? Well, there are many stories about Deepavali or Diwali. Let me share with you a story about Rama and his wife Sita. Long ago, Sita was imprisoned by a terrible demon king, Ravana. <laughs> Determined to save his wife, Rama sought the help of the monkey king, Hanuman. Together with Hanuman, Rama fought a mighty battle for 10 days until Rama used his magical arrow to defeat Ravana. Victorious, Rama and Sita returned to their land where everyone lit oil lamps to guide them on their journey and welcome them back home. And that is one of the many reasons why people light up lamps during Deepavali. Oh, I see! Wow, that's a really interesting story! Oh, I have a great idea, Jelaine. Shall we make our own lamp? <gasps> Sounds like a good idea. Let's go! Here is what you will need. Clear jar, white glue, permanent markers, flashlight or phone with flashlight, stickers, tape, and a plastic sheet. To make the lamp, this is what you need to do. Step 1. Using the glue, draw some shapes on the plastic sheet. You can draw different shapes like stars, hearts, or spirals. Step 2. Allow the glue to dry. Carefully peel off the glue from the plastic sheet. Step 3. Turn the jar upside down and paste the dried glue onto the jar. You can also add stickers if you like. Step 4. Color the jar with permanent markers. Step 5. Shine light into your jar. See your designs projected around the room. Do this in a dark room for the best effect. Step 6. Try moving the lamp around. Does that change how the patterns are formed? Step 7. Test the lamp out with different light sources. Different objects allow different amount of light to pass through. When light is unable to pass through an object, shadows are formed. You can make shadows of different colours and different shapes by using different materials like paper, plastic and even marker ink. Wow, this looks pretty! Well, I hope you had a good time making your very own lamp. Now that you have your own lamp, it's time for you to gather your family and friends around to retell the story of Deepavali. And do share your creations by tagging us or comment in the comment section below. Goodbye and, and happy Deepavali! Immerse in the world of light and shadow as we chase down the magical shadow in Chasing Light, an art-infused, action-packed science workshop developed by Singapore Repertory Theatre and Kids Stop for Preschoolers. Let's act, sing and dance your way through the core curriculum while meeting learning objectives through holistic classroom practice.